and welcome back. So these next few weeks, it's all about gifts and Christmas coming up. So uh, I got it, and I'm going to be making a couple things that uh, they're going to be on request order. Uh, a couple of them are going to be on the website, but this is going to be a phenomenal series. Um, I'm going to be trying to do it parallel together because there's not much time left, less than two months. So I'm going to be making uh, little dishes that uh, you put keys, coins, and stuff like that out of metal, and it's going to be really neat. Okay, I don't even have the equipment yet because I need a, a proper swage with a dip in it so I can pound it out to make a curve. It's going to be beautiful. You're going to see it. But on this series, where I'm starting today is I'm going to make an end table because right now I'm using an upside down laundry basket. and It's not the best. So it's going to be really cool. And there's going to be a secret for this end table. And it's going to be amazing. I'm only going to sell them for $150. But again, it's just going to be one of those things where you're going to have to uh, go ahead and email me uh, at my web uh, blade shop at uh, ltdforge.com and I'll be able to put one together for you. Uh, but yeah, very exciting times. going to be lots of gifts, lots of giveaways. So stay tuned. Check it out until the end, and we'll get that giveaway going. All right? Thank you for watching.
So these are really cool. I found these knobs that'll make perfect little feet, and that's why I got them. And they're gonna be the feet of the drawer. Now, I'm not, a, like I said, I've only been welding for about six weeks, but small stuff, nothing like this. If there's any professionals or better known welders out there, if you could help me out, how do I stop the splash zone from all the sparkles? Because that just was a pain and to have to grind it off and you know reshape it and everything to fit the knobs in there. If you guys know of a better way, especially like putting on nuts to not get it in the threads, things like that, that'd be much appreciated. Please leave a comment down below about that. Here are the uh, spacers I'm going to put between the frame and the feet to give it a little bit more extension. Um, I just use a circular grinder or bit there to knock out these knobs. I'm going to paint them black and put them right underneath the uh, feet between the uh, pedestal I welded on and the actual screw. 
but yeah that's it finished um i like it since it's for me i cut a lot of corners because of cost and everything but yeah this was just a basic plan i picked up 